All right, as we get ready, sponsor cup. Down the back straightaway, Devin Hines, Mark Mattel, and Jake Gunn. End of the first lap, Devin Himes getting the start again. Mark Mattel, Jake Gunn. Cam Kobo back in fourth, Ryan Cook fifth. Here we go side by side as Gunn. Devin Himes is over the berm now as this is what Jake Gunn needs. Now Devin Himes is gonna have to ride his heart out to see if he can climb back into this thing and have a, uh, a chance. Still, Mark Mattel, Jake Gunn, one, two, and then Coville. Coville keeping the tempo here on the 450 Honda. Question is, can Devin Hines have enough time to at least get a uh, fourth and keep it uh, close going into the last round? This time around, the white flag gonna be flying. Mark Mattel heading home. As Gunn still second, Coville third. Coville trying to make the move here on the final lap as he's gonna give it one last shot. As I think Mattel is gonna win the battle, but Jake Gunn is closer to winning the war, as that's the way they're gonna finish here tonight in the Quad Sponsor Cup Series. Mark, you had a little bit of time off from Dade City, but uh, welcome back here. Coming back with a bang there with a 2-1. Congratulations on the overall win. Yeah, um, throughout the year we were pretty busy and uh, you know, we were doing really well at the Nationals, and, and we were just taking it conservative, and uh, now that we finished and got our new uh, 12 bikes built, you know, we're coming out, testing them, and uh, 
So far, it looks like we're doing pretty good. Awesome job. I'll tell you what, you liking uh, the new track here at Dade City? Yeah, uh, I was a little disappointed that I didn't get to come out and ride on the free ride day, but, uh, you know, stuff happens. Uh, but I'm definitely liking the new layout. All right, congratulations. Is there anybody you want to thank? Uh, I got to thank my mom and dad, my girlfriend, Samantha, uh, Tommy for washing my bike, you know, my dad for making sure my grip stayed on. <laughs> You know, the Spears with STI, uh, Bloma Motorsports, PP Shocks, JB Racing, Yoshimira, SSI Decals, Ditch Witch, Extreme Power Sports, uh, Mal Racing, um, DWT Rims, uh, everyone. All right. Mark Mattel coming away with the overall victory. Y'all give him a hand. Is he going to take the win tonight? This time it uh, worked out for you, and you're one step closer to the championship. Yeah, first moto, I was charging them corners, and I went really fast into it, and it turned out I had no front brake. So I blew the berm, Mark almost got around me, then I blew the other berm because I had no front brake still. So I was kind of babying the whole moto, trying to use my back brake. You know, I'm not too good at using the back brake too much, but uh, this moto, the brakes worked good, and I uh, saw Devin mess up in the corner, and... I heard somebody behind me the whole race, so I didn't want to let off too much because I, I tried looking back to see who it was. But, you know, I was trying to play it smart, try to keep my points good, and it turned out pretty good tonight. Awesome job. I know you got some uh, people you want to thank. Yeah, I definitely thank Ripex, <coughs> Extreme Honda, Power Sports, George over at BPM, Matt Blommel. Um, Mar actually, Mark Maddow for getting my bike tuned in last race. Um, big Gun Exhaust, my mom, my dad, Walsh. Uh, uh, my girlfriend, Charles, there's just so many people that helped me out, iMoto, Kenny, uh, Barfield, Messengers, just been a tough year, and I'm just, one more race left, and thank God it's over. All right, Jake Gunn, going to end up with a second place spot. Devin, uh, it seemed like you kind of had it there in the bag, and you uh, missed that rut, kind of got cross rutted but uh, you could have, like, ended it there, but you fought back, and you still put yourself uh, in position where something could happen on the final round. Yeah, it's uh, pretty unfortunate. We had a good weekend going. Uh, spot on i mean whole shots down to everything everybody's getting good jumps off the gate everybody's riding clean i just it was my fault tonight team everybody from the team helping out bike was perfect couldn't been any better track was great dream track's doing a great job uh it just kind of blew it tonight really it was turned around to be a pretty good night from after the first moto looks but that's what that's the way it goes coming down to the points chase and uh we still got one race left you never know what's going to happen there you go. You still got yourself in position. Congratulations. I know you got a lot of people, too, that help you out. Yeah, after the mistake, just wanted to make my charge and make sure I was back up here on the podium for all the sponsors. Like I said uh, last time, my wife, mom, dad, uh, Marty and Sundas uh, helping me out with this bike. Williams Racing, in Racing Engines keeping the bike going or the engine built. Uh, STI helping me out. Goggles, tear-offs, gear, whatever I may need. Uh, Moto Works Exhaust, Blumma Motorsports, Tag Metals, Wrath Racing, DWT. Uh, PEP, Walsh Racecraft helped me out great. Uh, they're right here locally in Florida. Tag Metal, Sky Power Sports, Iron Horse Motorsports, right here locally. DWT Wheels, uh, Florida Highwaymen. I mean, just everybody. If it wasn't for all my sponsors, yeah, I, I wouldn't be here right now. All right, Devin Hines, the 2010 champion, keeping it close to only 80 points. We'll divide the two going into the final round.